Early voting now underway for November's midterm elections. Yeah, several races are on the ballot, including Texas Attorney General and Governor. Dan is live this morning with the details. Dan. Brandon, on a national level, this midterm election has generated enormous attention in part because control of the U.S. House and Senate is up for grabs. Here in Dallas County, voting's been underway since 7 a.m. Polls will remain open today until 7 p.m. Registered voters can cast a ballot at any polling location in their county. The biggest races involve statewide seats, including governor, lieutenant governor, attorney general, land commissioner, and state com comptroller. In addition, there are district-based elections for the U.S. House, as well as the Texas legislature, the state board of education, city and county leaders. The latest polling on the governor's race shows incumbent Greg Abbott expanding his lead over Democratic challenger Beto O'Rourke. A new poll from the Texas Politics Project at UT Austin shows Abbott with an 11 point advantage over O'Rourke uh, just before this past weekend. Voters in the city of Dallas deciding whether to approve a $1.5 billion proposal to build a new downtown convention center and revitalize six fair park venues. It would be funded by an increase in the city's hotel tax, not by taxing residents. Today marks the start of 12 consecutive days of early voting. It ends uh, Friday, November 4th, Election Day itself, Tuesday, November 8th. You can find out more about where to vote and all of the races at fox4news.com on our homepage or on the Fox 4 News app. Reporting live at the Samuel Grand Rec Center, East Dallas, Dan Godwin on Good Day.